Hello everyone, today we are going to a zoo in Frankfurt, Germany. So this was a train station and it was so interesting because in train stations in London we don't have designs on the walls and these were interesting. So here the train was coming and it was actually quite packed so we didn't really get a seat but that's fine, we just stood up and it was actually quite quick and then we came to the zoo train station this was the train station and it was a one minute walk towards the zoo and you can literally see they have pictures of animals on the walls when we first entered the zoo we saw camels and these camels are different to the ones I've seen before so I was like whoa okay and behind them we saw alpacas and they were baby ones, they were so cute I was most excited to see them but we didn't get to see, up, see them up close, which was a bit unfortunate. And these birds were so cool, they looked a bit evil if you ask me. Peacocks walking together, so cute. The gorillas were eating beetroot, and I'm not sure about the other one, it looks familiar. But if you guys know, then make sure to leave in the comment below. But they were so cool, like they were baby ones, and they were big ones, and I was like, whoa, I was mesmerized. Look, the baby one is just so small and just playing around the whole time. It was so funny. This monkey was actually kind of funny. <laughs> Whatever it was doing, it was really cute. And it was so cool to see the mother and the child. And the child was clinging on for dear life. Like it's about to fall any second. Like I would be scared for the baby as well. Like I was. Now I just want you to see this baby monkey for yourself. I was like, what? Oh my god. It's just doing so many tricks. It was so cute. Like it's eating food upside down. Now this gorilla was definitely the boss. You could just see by its face. It's so cool. Gorillas are extremely strong. And this gorilla was literally just like going around on top of our heads and I was like, whoa, he's so close to us. And there's this baby one. The baby one was the cutest. Just look at how innocent this gorilla baby looks. I'm not joking when I say this. I really wanted to play with this. It's so cute. And I think it was biting the tree. This gorilla stayed on top of our head for a long time, but we couldn't really see its face because of the sun, but it's fine. And the baby was just really just, we just stood there just looking at the baby with smiles on our faces. We came over to the meerkat section, and I'm not joking, I actually expected meerkats to be way bigger than this, but they were tiny. Maybe these ones were babies? We came over to the bird section, it was a bit hidden off. But I'm glad we found it because this bird just looks straight up evil but cute. Like it's just looking at us like what are you, what are you doing here? And these birds, I nearly mistook them for flamingos. These birds are really interesting like I'm sure you can see it. The bird is standing on one leg. Like it's standing on one leg and these legs are so thin. You couldn't see these gazelles properly because of the fence, but those horns were definitely sticking out. Now we came over to the small bird section and this bird was about to eat, I think, and we came and it's like, please go away, I'm trying to eat food. It's just looking at us. The most interesting bird out of all of them. As soon as we came out, this was happening and these monkeys are very popular for the way they look. And it looked like there were some leaders between them and apparently they were exercising, so that's so cool. This was happening for a long time. The peacocks as well. The peacocks were everywhere. So after that we just got a little tired. We were like let's just rest and just stare at this peacock. And it was so cute. We were trying to look for feathers that were on the floor that maybe it came out or something. This was the food area. There were lots of people here buying food. So we were like let's just buy a bottle of water. And we saw this kid chasing the peacock. It was so cute and funny. Like the peacock is running away. And at the end there were two of them. It was such a wonderful sight. We were trying not to feed them because we're not allowed. The section I was most excited for was the fish section. And there were really cool fishes everywhere. But I feel like this tank was a bit too small for them. They're really big fish. Like I'll show you in a minute. Do you see how big these fish are? Like I have a pet fish so I'm really interested in fish. I was like, whoa, like these are massive. I've never seen a fish this big. And these were really long. Like I was, actually these are my favorite fish I saw in the whole aquarium. 
They're just so long. This is this video I took a bit from afar so you can see how big these actually are and how less water it is. And there's turtles as well. So there's so many things and there's just really hardly any space for them. And this was a stingray. I was camouflaged. There was a reptile section if you climb the stairs and while you're climbing the stairs is were these fish and they were really interesting animals. These were really small turtles. A python. It was a royal python. You could also see shedded skin in the tank. These was frogs. They were just chilling. More snakes here. Now this snake was really interesting because of its face. Because look how the face is shaped. It's uh, a bit. And these were crocodiles. They just looked so lazy. <laughs> Crickets. A bit creepy. And I think this was a lizard. I'm pretty sure this was an iguana. Or a lizard. <laughs> I'm not joking when I say this. These fish had glow in the dark eyes. We're on to the tropical fishes now. And there were so many corals. Corals I'm interested in, in a bit these days. So many different kind of fish. Shrimps. I really want shrimps in my tank. More of this fish because why not? And these were the corals I was talking about. These, if you've watched Finding Nemo, you'll definitely know what this is about. They're actually so bright. Like it actually hurts your eyes looking at them and I really love that. I'm not sure what these fish are called, but I did see them somewhere and I remember it being really expensive. So I was like, whoa, expensive fish. One of the coolest sights I saw in the zoo, a rhino and a hippopotamus. When we arrived, its head was below the water, but when we were about to leave, it rose its head, I think, to breathe. So I was like, oh my god, we got lucky, like we got to see its face. It was actually not that scary looking like I've seen so many in like so many videos like hippopotamus being really destructive but it was actually kind of cute. It's just looking everywhere and there are a few people with us as well and his body was actually massive. It was like huge. This is probably the best video I made in the zoo. They were swimming and it was like they were putting up a show for us. It was really nice. These are seals. We saw three on land and the rest were I guess under the water. And near the seals were penguins. Penguins. When they were walking, it was the most funniest thing. And they were, but mo most of them were just standing there, still like uncomfortable or something. Back to the camel section. Beautiful as always. And these zebras. Oh my god, the zebras! I was so amazed about how much they look like donkeys. I never realized, but they look like donkeys. But anyway, this one was just like on his back, rolling around everywhere. It was a bit scary, but. It is what it is. Okay, but the giraffes, I was speechless. I was speechless when we saw the giraffes. They were so tall. They were far away, so we couldn't see them up close. But they're actually so tall and so innocent looking. An arctic fox. I was so shocked when I saw the arctic fox. And this really unicorn looking animal, I did not know what it was. It was my first time seeing this animal. It looks just like a unicorn, but a bit less colourful. And I'm not gonna lie, it looks a bit friendly, like it was just looking at me in a friendly way. I have that feeling. By the way, if you don't know how giraffes drink water, this is how they drink water. Another one of an animal that made me speechless, like its neck. There was a big crowd around the flamingos and they were really cute, I have to say that. I don't know what this animal was, but it looked like a goat. But here's the real goat. There was a small child that was feeding it leaves and I wanted to try to but I don't, I guess just the goats didn't really like me. I tried petting it but then it just walked off like it didn't like me. But they all liked the kid. I guess she was feeding them leaves. That's why. You can see how eager they are to eat the leaves. And this wraps up today's vlog. Hopefully it wasn't too boring. Subscribe, hit the like button and make sure your notifications are on for future videos.